Hey beauties, today is the day that I do my big chop. I'm sitting outside of the barber shop right now waiting for my barber to get here. And I have, at first I was just gonna cut into a fade, but I'm gonna just go ball and start completely over again. That's the best way for me. I just rather start all over, do some scalp care while my hair is going out and all of that. and. Start all over. Shaving your head is an emotional thing. It just is. I'm bald again. <clears throat> okay. So, feel a little better. I ate a little breakfast and I'm up for the challenge. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna stop looking at my head, y'all. But within the three years that I was natural, these two areas had very minimum, minimal growth. So I'm gonna take a different approach. Um, the first time I was just anxious. I, I looked at my hair every day, waiting for the stages. I, I had never seen my head really. Um, and so everything was completely new. This time around, I'm going to focus on my scalp care, hair care, and see what happens. I'm gonna get a derma roller to roll in the areas that I'm having problems. I'm going to mix some essential oils that I know are very good for my scalp. Some oils don't agree with my, my face. Uh, they break me out. So I'm going to have to be very careful in the oils that I use. I plan on using aloe vera, uh, grapeseed oil, peppermint oil, and um, maybe one more. But I'm fine with those. I'm gonna mix those up and use them and the derma roller and the aloe vera. Keep my head good and moisturized. I'm gonna even steam cap my scalp steam to, to open everything up and then I'll I will apply the oils and everything and you know I, I just have a plan and I'm sticking to it. My intentions are to focus on my problems area and get that hair to grow because the rest I know will grow. So that's, it's just about growing healthy hair in those areas. But, but this is getting that hair to grow. So that is my focus this time. Mm -hmm. 